Hey guys, it's TX Brad, and today we're going to be looking at a backboard from Keyway Designs. Now, this backboard is for the iPhone 4 and 4S. Now, what's neat about this backboard is uh, it's used with different woods uh, that gives your iPhone a different look. So, take a look at the inside of this package. The first thing we're greeted with is the backboard itself. Uh, now, basically, this backboard is like a thin layer of wood uh, that's on a back plate. I mean, it's like really thin. Uh, I had a choice of several different woods that I could choose from. I chose mahogany. Uh, I think it looks really, really nice. And as you can see too, I also have my logo on the back of it as well. Uh, they went ahead and uh, wood branded it in there. And so it looks really, really nice. So taking a closer look at the backboard itself, as you can see, you got the cutout there for the camera as well as the flash. That's a spot on cutout. I mean, it's exactly the way it is on the original backplate. And then on the back side of the backplate, you have uh, just the normal internal that you would normally see on a, on any other backplate itself. So the next thing in the package is the insulation guide itself. Uh, this will tell you how to install the backplate on your iPhone. So taking out the insert of the inside of this package, uh, we also have a microfiber cloth as well as screen protector so that way you can protect your screen. The next thing that's included in this package are these two screwdrivers. Now, the reason why you're going to need these is because, you know, since this is a back plate, back forward that you're taking off your iPhone, you will need to take the screws off in order to replace this plate. You might be asking why there's two set of screwdrivers. Uh, and the reason why for that is depending on what type of iPhone you have, whether you have the 4 or the 4S, uh, will determine the type of screws that you have so they kindly included both screwdrivers so you're able to take both sets of screws out also in the package is a set of screws i guess uh, just in case if you have something happen to your screws uh, you do have an extra set of screws uh, to put the back plate on so that was really nice that they included those as well so we're going to go ahead and do the installation of this backboard on my iphone uh, i will mention this though uh, taking the back plate off your iPhone may or may not void your warranty. I'm not really sure on that one, but just keep that in mind that uh, if you do replace the backboard, uh, that you may be voiding your warranty. So that is worth noting. Uh, so keep that in mind. The first thing we're going to be doing is actually taking the screws off. That's what the installation guide says to do. So we're going to go ahead and take the screws out. There's uh, two screws on the bottom. And they're located where the 30 pin dock connection is. There's a screw on either side. At least that's how it is on my iPhone 4S. So once you get the last screw out, the next step you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna press on the back of the plate and pull up. As you can see, it will release it. And then from there, you're able to grab from the bottom and take the back plate off. And there you go. Now you have the, the back plate off itself. And as you can see, you see the inside of the iPhone. So the next thing we're going to want to do now is put the new backplate on. But before we do that, uh, there is a piece of film that's, uh, that's on the back of the camera hole itself. Uh, they did mention to remove that, um, I guess that's part of the process on making it. So uh, make sure you remove that film before you put the backplate on. So now with the film removed, you are ready to put the backplate on. Uh, so now you just basically... Uh, turn it over and put it on the iPhone itself and you put it on exactly the same way that you took the back plate off Just lay it on there and then you press it forward and then it'll be locked in place So once you have the new back plate installed uh, the next thing you're going to want to do is go ahead and put your screws back in uh, So that way the back plate is secured. So once you get both screws installed that pretty much concludes the installation of the backboard itself I have to say it looks really nice. Keyway Designs did a fabulous job on this backboard. Um, it just looks really nice with my iPhone. I think I did a real good uh, wood selection uh, going with the mahogany. As you can see, the cutouts are spot on with the camera and the flash. I mean, it looks just exactly the way the original would look. Uh, and so overall, it just looks really nice. It doesn't add any bulk at all to my iPhone. So I have to say my hat's off for Keyway Designs for doing this. I have to say I love the details of this backboard itself. Uh, it looks really nice. Uh, it's got that nice wood feel to it. And having my logo engraved like that, it just it looks awesome. They did an awesome job on this backboard. 
Now the retail on this, if I remember correctly, was probably around $45 to $50, uh, which you might think that might be a little too high, but in my opinion, it's really not because to have a unique uh, design like I have, uh, a unique backboard, uh, you can't put a price on that. I mean, yeah, like I said, Keyway did a really good job on this and it does add uniqueness to your iPhone. I mean, when people see your iPhone out on the street, they're going to be, they're going to notice that. And so, uh, to me, I think it's well worth the price. Now, since I've got this backboard done, uh, they've revamped their inventory. And so now they have what's called wood skins as well. Uh, now these wood skins are basically, it's, you know, skin that you would put on your backplate instead of having the backplate itself like I got here. Uh, it's actual skin that you put on. Uh, supposedly it's really good. Uh, I've looked at the, the pictures, the selections that you can choose from, and they look really nice. So, and they retail for around $45. Uh, some of, there is some logos that you can get on them as well. And I think they are doing, or if they're not doing it at, I think they are going to be offering custom engraving as well. So you can get, you know, your logo or whatever, like I have here, uh, on the skin itself too. So I think that's really nice that they're adding those. So that concludes the review of this backboard by Keyway Designs. I would like to thank Keyway Designs for sending this out for review. I really appreciate it. And guys, don't forget to check out their link down in the description below for other fine products. And also, don't forget to hit that like button as it really helps me out. And check out my social links, twitter.com slash txbrad, as well as facebook.com slash txbrad. And we'll see you all in my next video.